we just finished the game very, very recently, so at uh, this time, um, we really worked really hard to, uh, to uh, develop the story and uh, to, uh, to develop the characters through the, the story. And uh, to do so, we, uh, we um, improved our uh, tools. Our, uh, and I'm going to talk about the uh, animation tools because that's my, uh, my job. I'm a Treyarch animation director. And uh, so we improved, the, 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 especially the, the facial, um, facial animation tools. And uh, to improve the, the, we use a technique called full performance capture, uh, a technique similar to what uh, uh, they used on Avatar, where you, you can record the, the voice, the body uh, movement, and the, the facial at the same time as opposed to uh, recording the voice, body and face at different times and, and, and sometimes even with different actors. This time around we actually uh, use this full performance capture where we, uh, we, ca we, we record everything at once and which really improve the, the way uh, characters emote. They, uh, you can really see the emotions and uh, you, you can keep the integrity of the, uh, the performance of the actor. The player is surrounded with a group of uh, uh, um, special ops, and uh, through uh, through uh, different countries. If so, you follow the the, the, the character. The, the player follows his uh, his his teammates uh, in different countries: um, Russia, Cuba, um, Vietnam, and Laos. And I think the the player really feels part of the of the team. For multiplayer, we have uh, we uh, introduced different uh, new uh, game mode, and uh, we have also a, a wager match and a training camp. I'm uh, I'm very excited about training camp. It's a new uh, new feature where you can play by yourself. Uh, you you play against enemy AIs, and uh, I think it's gonna it's gonna, it, it, it's, it's gonna allow the, uh, the the casual players to uh, to uh, to uh, access multiplayer, which can be sometimes intimidating or frust frustrating. Um, myself, I'm not a hardcore multiplayer player, and uh, and uh, I've I found myself like playing over and over because it's it's very addictive. You can you know you can get used to the the, 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 the game modes. You can uh, customize your weapons. You can actually learn the multi multiplayer side without like. Uh, and, and, and you can take you, you can do it at, at your own pace, basically. How about the, uh, the wager match? You earn money. You earn like Call of Duty uh, money, and you can actually use this money and bet against your uh, your friends and then obviously you can win but you can also also lose all your uh, your money so that's uh, actually very very uh, very fun um, there's also a uh, a lots of customiz customiz customization you can customize your your avatar your, you can customize your 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 character um, you can also uh, customize your weapons. You can even create your own logos. So uh, there's a uh, there's a lot of new uh, features. It's a real pleasure, like to be here to uh, to talk about the game, and uh, it's been a real pleasure to work on uh, Black Ops. We uh, at Treyarch, we we uh, really work really hard to uh, to make the, the the game the best game possible, and uh, I hope. Uh, people enjoy. The worldwide uh, release date is the November 9th and uh, it's gonna be on uh, Xbox 360, on PS3, on PC and on the Wii.